short video overview of how to properly set the safe tank in place at your facility. It is critical that you have the bellows transition alignment sleeve aligned correctly and that you have a crane or boom truck available to do this. Connect your lifting chains to the lifting straps that are located on the top of the tank assembly. These straps are designed to move the tank off the truck and to set it into place while it's completely empty. When you lift the safe tank assembly off the truck, set it on the ground carefully. Keep the lifting straps installed until you're ready to set the tank in its final place. Once you have the tank pad prepared, gently set the safe tank in place. Make sure that the bellows transition fitting is aligned with the plumbing that will be installed at your facility. You can now remove the nylon straps from the top of the tank. You might save them in case you need to move the tank again at some point down the road. Again, these straps are designed to lift the tank empty. Ensure the line on the alignment sleeve lines up with the outside edge of the tank. The alignment sleeve must be centered and the gap must be equidistant around the sleeve. This must be done while the crane or boom truck is still available. This will ensure proper spacing between the two tanks. If adjustments are needed to the bellow transition fitting, connect your crane or boom truck to the lifting lugs on the primary tank. Lift up on the primary tank slightly, just enough to free up the alignment sleeve for adjustment. Adjust the alignment sleeve so it is centered and the gap is equidistant around the sleeve. Once again, ensure the line on the alignment sleeve lines up with the outside edge of the tank. Measure again to ensure the line on the alignment sleeve lines up with the outside edge of the tank and the alignment sleeve is centered. After alignment is confirmed and the alignment sleeve is centered, you are ready to move on to step two, which is installing the rest of the transition fitting. Those instructions can be found in the safe tank installation video part two, as well as our installation and operation guide found on our website at polyprocessing.com.